Good morning, you guys. Thursday. We're almost halfway through the week. Um, it is like 7 o'clock in the morning. I have an appointment coming. I'm here in a minute. I have something to do. But I wanted to ice my face with you guys. I already had already took a shower. I slept good. Finally, I got some really good sleep. After doing laundry, I had to stop. And it took forever while I was recording. Because what had happened is I was recording and my phone kept shutting off. Saying that I didn't have enough storage. So I had to take all the videos off my phone. Put them on my laptop. It was just a bunch of stuff I had to do. It took so much time. Um, because I, I couldn't just throw them on my laptop. Like, I, I also, it was just a bunch. It doesn't, it's too much explaining. But anyways, yeah, so I did that. And then after I had got done, that's when I finished up my laundry. And then literally after I got done talking to you guys, I got in the shower. And I was knocked out. So tired. I can't believe I was going that long yesterday. That's crazy. I went to bed like that right at like 11.30. And I was just gonna wait and finish up my laundry today. But then I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna push through it. And we did. But at least all the laundry's done. But yeah, I woke up super early this morning. Like at 6. Um, and then I got in the shower. I cleaned up, got lotioned up, got dressed for work. I gotta put on my work shirt. That's usually what I do. I'll literally throw on my work shirt like right down the street or even in the parking lot at work. Sorry if I'm talking loud, I sound like it's sleeping and I don't want to be too loud. I'm trying to de-poof my eyes. They were so poofy yesterday. But yeah guys, this is what I normally do. Not every single day, but I need a little towel. A little towel. Oh yeah, I have one right there. Oh, here's one. This, is, this one's clean. This is the only thing that sucks about it, is when you're doing it, it tends to start melting really quick. But I feel like that's even like the ice rollers, like the really good ice rollers, they're ice. The one that I have isn't actual ice, like you put it in there, put it in the freezer, you guys seen it. Put it in the freezer and then it gets really, really cold. But it gets warm so fast, like it does not stay cold, I cannot do that. I don't want it to be freezing on my face. I want to do another uh, Cairo session on my face. And for my birthday, I really want to get myself a facial. I think I'm going to. And when I get the, I think it's called like the Hydro Glow. I'll just set here, this here for a while. For a minute, deep poof these eyes. Cause they are. Oh, I need to tap my brows. I think I'll do that today. Oh no, that's what I was going to tell you guys. Um, so since my phone kept like literally going in, going out, going in, of the videos where it wouldn't let me record because it was saying I didn't have enough storage, today my goal, which I need to just do, it's not even a goal, I have to, after work, go to Verizon and get a um, SD card so I can have more memory on my phone so I don't run into those problems as much. I can't believe tomorrow's Friday. It's crazy. What a long week. I got two ice cubes. Usually I do one, but this one has two. I just try it. Sometimes I'll like hold it there for a minute. Yes, it's absolutely freezing. They just had to bear the pain. <laughs> so cold. And then the other side. Oh, and I have Cycle Bar. I totally forgot I had Cycle Bar today until I got the reminder this morning. So I'm off at four today. And my cycle bar class is at four. How am, when am I going to make the time to go to Verizon? I wonder what time Verizon closes. Or I can go to Best Buy. There's not enough time in the day. Anyways, I'm off at four at work. I have a cycle bar at 4.45 to 5.30. Um, then I got to go to Verizon, get the SD card, come home, make something for dinner for my kids. I need to put in my hair straightener. Yeah, yesterday we didn't have any, I didn't have any workout classes, but that was a workout. I got my chore done of doing all of the laundry. And I want to clean up my bedroom. It's not getting really, really messy like it was. The problem is, guys, is I, I don't use my bedroom at all other than, like, bring stuff in here, but, you know, but that's, like, how it gets, met, gets cluttered. Like, I'll just throw something on the bed or throw this and then... I'm never in here to be keeping up on it. So then when it starts getting dirty, I'm like, okay, I gotta get in here and clean. 
I'm gonna journal. So this is like a lot of how I do my self-care. I will make the time if that's waking up earlier or, you know, making the time in the evening to decompress, do something, whether it's a foot mask, icing your face, just doing something that will make you feel better. This is gonna make me feel better. <laughs> After this, I'm gonna put on some ser my some of my face serum and then I hate how the light keeps going in and out. That's my thing. But yeah, that's kind of like what I mean when I refer to like you guys like getting things, doing a lot of self-care. It doesn't have to be working out. It could just be doing, motivating yourself to do something you don't want to do and pushing through it because you know it'll be better for you. So like that yesterday, you guys seen how bad I did not want to go to laundry, do laundry. I was so tired, especially since I did not go to bed till three o'clock in the morning. I was so tired because I was up all night editing. I was like, I should really just take care of myself and go get rest but then I was like no I know that I'm gonna I'll be up all night if I sleep right now at that time and I knew that I could feel that when I I would go to bed early and I would get good sleep and I did so just taking care of yourself or chores or something that you can motivate yourself to get done it'll make you feel better in the long run okay all the ice is melted let me get a paper towel. Dry my face because I don't dry my face I don't try to dry my face with towels just a second Okay, I have a paper towel. I can fat dry it. You guys, I don't know if I showed you this serum that I got. It's called Hope. The brand is Hope in a jar. I feel like they have like a cream moisturizer. I can't really remember correctly. I'm pretty sure they do. I'm sure I've seen it at Ulta. Well, anyways, this is where I got it, obviously. But it's this... It's Hope in a Jar, the brand, it's Philosophy, Hope in a Jar, um, Balance Glow Serum. Anyways, I really like it. I forgot all about it, um, until after a while. In my Ulta bag, because I saved it in there, because I wanted to show you guys, and then, that's the thing, because when I get new products, I really, I I really don't use them um, until I show you guys. I like showing you guys first. Anyways, so it's a serum. Can't forget our neck. And I feel like I really like it. I will definitely repurchase it. I feel like it does help my skin look, you know, healthy, glowy. Then after that, when that dries, I usually will put a tiny bit of this on. I've loved it so far. I did open this with you guys, I'm pretty sure. The Peter Thomas Roth um, Potency Bright and Plump Moisturizer. I really like this one. Yeah. But I'll let this dry and then I go in with that. And then I love this one. I'm getting a big one of this. I don't know why I love it so much. It just feels good on my skin. I feel like it does do something. It's the Origins Ginseng um, Gel Moisturizer. So I'll put that one on. But I feel like when I went to go get a bigger bottle of it, um and order a bigger bottle of it at the time. I was kind of looking at the reviews and if I remember right, they didn't really have good reviews on that. If I remember right, I'm pretty sure they didn't. But that's again, like not everything works the same for everybody. You know, if I like something that doesn't necessarily mean it's gonna be so great on your skin or you're gonna love it, you know? Everybody's skin is different. So I'm like, I like this. I don't know what, what the reviews are about, but then I realized what I just said, and I was like, oh yeah. So anyways, I don't even know why I'm doing my hair, because it's just going to get super sweaty after cycle bar this evening. That's okay. But yeah, so anyways, I like it, and I want to get a bigger bottle of that, because I think it's really good. I don't use a lot of products. Sometimes less products is more, in my opinion. You don't necessarily have to use all these things, like a bunch of serums, and you know, just like making sure you're drinking plenty of water, you're eating healthy, can do your skin wonders. My problem is making sure I'm getting in enough protein. I'm really trying to get in enough protein in my diet every day, and it's so hard because I'd rather eat fruit all day. <laughs> Well, not all day, but I'd rather eat fruit than a piece of chicken. That's just me. 
I love chicken, but I will take watermelon over chicken any day. That's why I drink that protein coffee that I showed you guys. Oh yeah, I think I remember asking you guys if you know a good protein coffee that doesn't have soy. Will you leave it in the comments because I really want to try something else that has kind of better ingredients. I have one, but it's not a coffee based one. It's just like a chocolate protein one, and it is from, I'll show you guys later, hopefully if I don't forget. It's, a, it's pretty clean ingredients, but I don't, I want a little bit of caffeine in it. I tried mixing espresso in it. No, it's, it's not a good mix. Not a good mix. Alright, let's put this, stop doing this for a minute and put on, put on this. We're going to put this on. We let our serum sink in. This I put on my neck. Oh, I want to get one of those neck rollers, guys. I've seen them, you know, like the jaw. Um, just remember that. I seen a girl using one, and I'm like, oh my god, that's a really good idea. I really want one. Will it work? I don't know. Doesn't hurt to try. And then we'll put this on this tiny bit. So literally adapt. This was so expensive. I try not, and it's really thick. Sometimes I like thick moisturizers, but sometimes they're like, it makes my face feel cakey. That's why I don't wear foundation anymore. One, I really don't need it. I don't need it, but it's, I don't need, I, I just would rather not have my foundation always look just like too cakey and I didn't like that. So I'm out of it that era of having to wear foundation. Concealer, I love concealer, but it's still... And I would use a good primer. I would use good things, but so costly. And I'm like, I'm just going to start taking care of my skin. And that's how I got into just doing my own skin stuff. I'm going to journal after this while I wait for my appointment. Because I will be done getting ready. And so then I'm going to journal and make my goals for the day. Anyways, why am I getting tired? Skin is shiny, but it's this on my face. How are we already at 23 minutes? This is why my videos are so long and then I take forever to edit them because they're like 15,000 hours long. But anyways, I hope that you guys have a good, almost said Wednesday, a good Thursday. I'm going to end this video here and start a new one this evening, if not tomorrow. I ain't got nothing going well I have stuff going on this evening but don't forget your chapstick this is the best chapstick I've found aquaphor and there's another one I can't remember what it's called but it's really good too I love chapstick I hate dry lips but oh, what? oh I can tap my brows with you guys if not we can do that together tomorrow anyways I'll see you guys later you guys have a good Thursday yeah, 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 yeah. Let me say, oh, 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 yeah.